with Yoshi, quick play with Pikachu. You're going to devastate an Incineroar. Incineroar is slow, but but hits hard. But I mean, Yoshi is tanky and Pikachu's light. We'll see if he switches at all. So at the same time, if Incineroar gets the download on Yoshi, Yoshi has a second bracket to come through yeah. on loser we are, to grab the Pikachu. We are in a best of five where if the Incineroar wins it, he wins the whole thing. But at the same time, Yoshi has a whole second stock to mess with. I tell you what, that 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 Yoshi, I don't know. Like I kind of expected Pikachu out the gates because he doesn't have time to download. But I mean, if he's good with Yoshi, if he gets a win with Yoshi, then this is a great strategy. But I mean, his Yoshi's dirty. Don't get me wrong, his Yoshi's dirty. But that Pikachu is devastating. I'm more terrified of that Pikachu for sure. Being, what about you, Mike? Being a three or five, he has the chance, the opportunity to switch between characters if he has to. I think his Pikachu. Oh, the I, forward air spike! I think his Pikachu is way more deadly, but at the same time, Yoshi has that fair he spike. He has to answers. Close it out. He has answers, folks. And I can't say real quick because he closes it out at 110 percent. Ooh. But at the same time, but still, that 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 is such a satisfying move. Just headbutt him into the the dang ground. It's so time, satisfying. Yoshi knows what he's doing. I, I, I'm going to go ahead and predict. I think we're going to see an Incineroar Yoshi counter soon. That down here. We're going to see. He got a kill. He's at 53%. I feel like he's going to charge up his counter. We might see a big hit soon. And another thing with Yoshi. Yoshi has a weird recovery. I don't want to say bad. I don't want to say good. It's really weird. It's a jump, and then he gets a little tiny hop off that upbeat. It's really weird. He doesn't have an oh, my God. Wait. Did he just kill him at 55 Yoshi just killed him at 55. He killed him a little bit past 65, but at the same time... No, he was at, he was at 55. He did a, a combo with a finisher and killed him. That and, was dirty. And off the ledge, Yoshi's slow. I guess it's hard enough to kill him off the side. Man. Yoshi's this, this, this Yoshi's getting the download while winning. The Incineroar might get the download on the Yoshi in this set, but if the Yoshi wins this set and then goes Pikachu, he could, he could go away with the strategy and it work out for him. I wouldn't be surprised if set two, game 10, game 9 maybe... We see a third character come out from that Yoshi. Oh, that'd be insane. We see the Yoshi. That'd be insane. We I would love this. He I would love that. Out of both of them. He brings out Mewtwo. Third one. Lucario. Let's get another Pokemon. Let's just throw in another I want more Pokemon. <laughs> Sword and Shield's out, folks. We need Pokemon in this tournament. <laughs> One man plus out the Jigglypuff. I tell you what, Yoshi at is at almost maximum. Oh, he did not have a recovery. He didn't realize. I don't think he knew he didn't have his jump, or else he could have upbeat and he could have been fine. But at the same time, Yoshi has a one keep recovery. Yoshi doesn't have an upbeat. Yoshi only has a double jump. Honestly, a fair spike wins it. And a fair spike wins it. That'll do it. I don't I don't see the general coming back. Yep. Edge guard with the down smash, charging up that smash for that ledge Game trap. Game one, going to my man, Afro Toad. You know, when you only have one life to go, sometimes the ledge trap is the best option. It's so much safer. So much safer. If you can time that two frame window, ledge trapping's the way to go. And you know what? Afro Toad played him in winner's final. Afro Toad knows how this Incineroar plays. Yeah, yeah. He had all of the rest of the loser bracket to figure out in his head. But now this Incineroar, this Incineroar, he's the one that put Afro Toad in the losers. He is. So he's got a lot downloaded. I'm actually, you know, this next game, he might go Pikachu, he might stick with Yoshi. Honestly, it's probably better to stick with Yoshi. He got a win under his belt. Keep it going, with Yoshi. If he if he wins the set, switch to Pikachu. Just keep him on his toes. That's what I, was gonna say. I see him sticking as Yoshi for all of set one. This man said two to avoid the download to make sure he doesn't get figured out. This so man knows how to mind game. He knows how to mind. He came from Michigan. He's like, I'm gonna fuck with these North Carolinian North Carolinian Bible Belt braids. I'm gonna mind game the fuck out of them. I also <laughs> I also wouldn't be surprised if set two after the reset. Incineroar switches name to secondary. I don't know if he has a secondary. I haven't seen it this whole tournament. I've only seen his Incineroar, but he maybe. He's been in winners. That would be interesting. But going into that would losers, be going into game five, going into game ten, he might need to switch it up. Dude, and right off how, the bat, how Yoshi high coming in. Ooh, Ooh Yoshi's Yoshi saying, doing? hey, I am oh. here. I am from Michigan, and I would like some money, please. <laughs> Midwest? More like mid-best. <laughs> Let's go, Michigan. <laughs> More like mid-best. I like it. Oh, coming in with the defensive recovery with that egg. There we go, Yoshi off the top. Ooh. Yoshi off the top. His spacing. He knows this character. He knows two characters better than I know one. You out? I'll see you on Monday. I'm going to finish commentary and Hannah's going to come pick me up. Nice to meet you. Thanks for hanging out. This has been great. Is Robert sticking around? Thanks for your beard, Dregs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> See you around, man. I'll see you on Monday. Yeah. I'll see you whenever. Kevin Wolf, we're not coming in on Monday.
I will see you guys again. I will be joining you for hangouts soon. <laughs> yes, we will be hanging out, getting drunk and playing Smash. You will get to know the Dirk. <laughs> yes. I'm bad at it. It takes a lot to get me there, but I'm good at the Smash part. I I'm not. So, so it works we out. We are Little just trick. two peas in a pod then. <laughs> Uh, adios, Alex. I'm pretty much the same level as Alex, and my main Durkle here knocked him out first round. Oh, Incineroar apparently got buffed, according to our one viewer right now. Incine well, three, actually, but one of them. He was here in the tournament, he said Incineroar is one of the ones that got buffed. That makes sense. This That's Incineroar has been doing work. People don't know the buffs. They don't know what to expect. In, 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 in update 6.0, I think only four or five characters got buffed, and all of them were and they were characters. big buffs. They buffed the Puff. <laughs> Yoshi got buffed. Kirby got buffed. Puff got buffed. Let's Ooh. go, Yoshi. Ooh. Going into game that's two three, and zero. Oh. He's, he's two and zero. One stack away from reset. I will say, this you can see him. You, he's he's moving in a certain way. You know he's a little tilted. Yoshi this Incineroar has got has lost two in a row. He's Yoshi. feeling the pressure, and I can see it in his face. This might make him even weaker if he lets this get to him. You gotta stay out of the mind games with this game. Yoshi was also up for a cool spot. Yoshi has the Incineroar figured out. Yoshi downloaded the Incineroar before the down before the Incineroar but could figure out him. From experience, I will say, getting destroyed that much by someone, you get the download from getting destroyed, and when you switch it up, you have a download and they do not. I, I can see him coming back with this. I can see it. I can see this being a good choice for him. Kalos 2, great stage. I can see this working out for him. I can see it. DDD okay. is dirty. Again, okay. at this point, I think... DDD has the ability to keep Yoshi at a distance to make that, sure he doesn't get those combos. That Gordo is a great spacing tool. And honestly, DDD gets a smash attack at 50, and Yoshi has to worry. Yoshi, Yoshi already is in worry range. DDD is strong. DDD is slow. Damn. But his attacks will kill you off the side. Mike, this. Mike, DDD has hit him four times. He's 115. Even 30% in him. Oh, my God. Over 100. DDD knows four what attacks. he's doing. Four attacks. With the pack, bro. At this point, man, this man hits hard. At this point, any smash attack will kill the Yoshi and even the game. Aerials. Up. Aerials, too. A lot will kill this Yoshi. Oh my gosh. But at the same time, Yoshi has those eggs to break the Gordos. He does. Him and deal with he damage. is fantastic. All the Yo, up air with the spinny hammer. That is a hitbox you gotta worry about. That is honestly, that up air is the up air version of Yoshi's down air. This is an interesting matchup. You're right. It kind of is. This is very interesting. I'd love to see a, an up air versus a down air and see which one wins. Where the priority lies, you know? This is crazy. This is a great grand finals. But if this Yoshi wins, it resets. It doesn't start over. If the DDD wins, he just keeps going. This is not the deciding match by any means, but it is an intense one. But at the same time, I haven't seen Buzz bust at the DDD in all this bracket. Me either. I don't know if the DDD needs to get warmed up. This is this might be his first tournament match. DDD's been winning Could winners be. the whole time. I honestly, don't know if he needs like, to bust his character out. Honestly, like. By the look of things, Incineroar DDD is a fantastic combination for this player. He's making things work. While he dis- And bringing it back. He, he, he got know, hit a little- But you know, if he could polish his DDD as much as that Incineroar, this could be a dirty switch. For sure. He's with making that, things happen. Back, though, trying to God, off stage. those hits are so scary. So scary. They hit so hard. Oh! The, the spot dodge. That spot dodge when he was in danger. That was brilliant. DDD's whole story. He's trying to rack up damage to that Gordo and then kill with either an air attack with an aerial or a smash, smash attack. Honestly, DDD hates this stage, I would think. It's an odd stage pick because DDD's up smash covers a whole platform on Battlefield. I'm surprised at Kalos, but we'll see if it works out. We will see. I think at this point, he didn't want to elude that he was switching characters. Oh, the Gordo and Point Blank to get him away. Incineroar doesn't kill off the top most often. He kills off the sides with that side beat. It is a good combo of heavy hitting characters that both deal with people differently. That Gordo. That Gordo is dirty. He is good at that Gordo. But at the same time, that Yoshi keeping it close. That, oh. that Yoshi's good at his eggs. This is a very interesting, similar matchup, really. Gordo versus eggs. Who's oh. going to win? Over 100%. Yoshi. Both of them. Easily Kill him if he, Both if he could die. Any sort of anything. If either character lands a smash attack, they are very equal. Gone. Two lives. Two lives still. There we oh, go. the point play oh. Gordo, but it just gave him some defense. It just gave him some room to breathe. It just gave him some room. To oh there my go. God, Yoshi there. said no breath for you. Let's go. No dogs. breath for you. <laughs> Man, this is intense. 
So Yoshi, even though Yoshi's up a stock now. But one good hit. And, one good hit and Yoshi does have a barely time, advantage. This is all Yoshi needs for a reset. He doesn't need a win by a lot of It is true. By a beat it to is get true. That reset. He's that gotta he's gotta just gotta inch ahead to reset the bracket. I wouldn't be surprised if at that reset Pikachu. We see DDD Pikachu. I would see because it. A, I could see it. We haven't seen yet. He doesn't, that he Pikachu goes out. so fast and so hard. It's what you want when you're hyped for the end, is Pikachu. I feel it. But I mean I I could see Yoshi again. Until he loses, I could see Yoshi. Also, he hasn't uh, lost yet, has also, he? Also, at Yoshi at 193, this is the highest oh! I've ever seen a Yoshi. Dude, I Both did not know Yoshi's match. egg reflected Gordo. That is important. Also, that DI, I'm surprised that first up air. Man. Took it took two up airs. Those up airs are nasty, though. This DDD knows what's up with those up airs, for sure. But Yoshi, that those eggs, I've never seen a Yoshi so on point with those eggs. Those are terrifying. It's like a second character he has to worry about almost. So at this point, Yoshi is still up pretty much a full stock. He's at 26 to 106. Ooh, it reflecting like the, the Gordo. The Gordo's not the answer for his eggs anymore. He can reflect the Gordo with his eggs. It's crazy. Gordo with any hitbox really bounces back. Yoshi's egg hitbox breaks it. But Yoshi's got time, way more defense. At the same time, DDD bringing it back brought Yoshi up to 80, oh my God. nearly 90%. It's anyone's match here. There we go. Yoshi bringing it to the reset. This is grand final set two. Zero, zero. Yeah. yeah.